All right, so we're going to load in exactly where we left off, which should be on the beach. Well, I just got in Shadowheart to join the, uh, the group, the party, the team, the band, the thing. Um, and we are going to go and adventure off in search of a cure for the tadpoles in our brains. So let's see what we've got going on here. With haste. Yes, indeed. Let's find more loot. This barrel. I don't know. Let's go open it up and find out. Money. Backpack. It just has a floppy hat in it, but it's still worth the gold piece. Oh, it's actually worth five gold pieces. I'm, must be a different hat I'm thinking of. It's like a beat up one to find somewhere around here. Always room for more. No traps, please. Bucket of fish. Pick up that book. Fresh water. There must be a settlement nearby. Hmm. Another more grass there. Guys, yeah, you know, have loot. Here goes Sigil. Nothing. Kablamo. I could go ahead and open the store now, probably, but um, there's a bunch of traps and stuff in there. I'm not really equipped for that yet. We're going from the other direction anyway. So we're going to go ahead and move up this way. And there will be some uh, intellect powers up here. Try not to. We'll stay over here. Loot some of this stuff here More before we. Oh, there they are. I think they'll retreat on the inside, and then we shouldn't have to worry about aggressing them. This should be the last. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Did I? Hmm. I feel like I did not get that yet. Because I didn't, but there was nothing in there. Okay. I think that does it for this area. Let's go ahead and engage our intellect devourers up here. Softer than a whisper. Uh, it would help if you would hide too. Yeah. Wits and blades always sharp. Okay, she's got a bow Maybe too. I okay. Stay crouched forever. Yeah. Just to crouch for as long as necessary. We're gonna try to hit this one here. Right there. Piercing shot. Sneak attack ranged. Nice. Better Nailed it. One strike could be lethal. Alright. Another step forward. Oh, never mind. That was a mistake. All right, I'm committed now. Okay, if they're dashing, they're not going to be able to attack me. Excellent. Yeah, I didn't kill it. Let's go ahead and throw the shield on this guy over here. This guy should be able to finish this other guy off. What's he got there? The piercing strike. Oh. Excellent. Well, not much else I could do, so I'm just gonna chill out here. Good miss. Splat. All right, excellent. Survival isn't such a distant prospect. Okay, let's go ahead and grab loot. Okay, this guy's a rapier, and I will go ahead and throw that right there. So it is the better weapon. What's inside? 
boys are. Speed. There's a dead guy up there. Go loot him. Alright, not bad. Until it devours rotted in the sun. Care about the bird grass, but I'll fix him up anyway. A bag of holding. Yes, it would be nice, wouldn't it? Up here, there he is. Hurry, I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like I look rather nonplussed. Uh, kill it yourself. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. What's with that look? That's a weird look. Um, let's do the dexterity check. Alright, rolling away. I saw you on the ship, strutting about whilst I was trapped in that pod. What did you and those tentacled freaks do to me? Uh, I haven't done anything to you yet. You arrogant little... Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on? Hmm. I'll just say number the worm. one. Of course. That explains things somewhat. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. Uh, glad to see we're all cut up now. Indeed we are. Please, allow me to introduce myself. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Uh, let's see. I'll do number three. My, my. You've been busy. So, did you learn anything about these worms while wandering the ship? Uh, they turn us into mind players. Turn yeah. us into... <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although, it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Sure. Um, shoo -doo 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 -doo. let's travel together. You know, I was ready to go this alone. But maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And anyone that can crash a mind flare ship and walk away seems like a good person to know. All right. I accept. 
Lead on. As he joins your side, your mind dances with thoughts of a perfect, pretty corpse. Oof. Wow. That was uh, interesting. All right, well, let's go ahead and level up real quick before we continue on here. But mm -hmm. Dark Urge. Indeed. All right, so we've got some actions here. Cool. That's going to be handy. This time, uh, let's make sure that we don't bypass the spell selection here. Turn undead, yep, yep. Duplicity, let's take a look at our spells preparation here. Guiding Bolt's actually pretty good. I don't know that Necrotic is, that's a melee. Let's take that one out. Three creatures receiving there. That's not bad, actually. That, that might be the one to go with. We need water. I don't really like that one. Yeah, I think in I think in Bane. Alright, got another rogue. Now that we were all squared away in one big happy family, more or less, let's go ahead and finish exploring this little area over here. We're going to go get Gale there in a minute. Just want to make sure that we have all of our things that we need to loot looted. Go up here, kind of complete the little loop. There, a mind flare. Approach the d you could end its life here and now if only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion. Uh, you should be yes, good. You feel hate. Yes. And feel you the deserve hatred. to be punished for it. What? You should be whipped, made to bow before this creature in shame. It's possessing your mind, forcing you to love it but then the feeling slips the creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere let's concentrate on its thoughts nice. your mind's views lusting for something that is gone but then its grip claws back with a vengeance a vice locking your mind into obedience it needs sustenance to survive, and with your very body, you can provide. Uh, we're gonna resist this. Good. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Close those eyes forever. Okay, I would have used the sword, but I guess that works. Monster. Death is too good for it. Yeah. Alright. I don't that's where Starium was at. I don't think it's good. Really anything else up here? All right, we're gonna head back down to this direction here. Start pinging my way over here. Come, my friendly people. Dead goblins over there. Worth What's checking the slide, maybe. Way? You approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Let's touch the sigil. <laughs> A hand? Anyone? Uh, hacking off the hand. 
<laughs> this branch of flesh is begging to be pruned, <laughs> and its sap sucked from. Oh, damn, dude, this is getting crazy. My mistress eyelids stop. Cease, you lose. Oh man. As soon as the dreams cross the threshold of your imagination, you snap back to realize they have all Oh come wow. True. Wow, that is crazy. Okay, well I guess we're not having him in the party now. You were supposed to lend a hand, not take one. <laughs> Joy floods through you. You were dazed on the Nautiloid, but now you are truly awake. Alive. Hmm. Damn. Damn, that was pretty harsh. Oh, man. That was crazy. Hey, where's the hand? All right, let's see. Huh. You look rabid. Pained. Sick. You're spasming and twitching. You poor thing. Uh, the memory improvement. What, what? There, number three. The norm is to keep dirty thoughts like that to ourselves, but do carry on. Uh, this is murder over and over. Ah. It seems you've been dealt a vile hand. I say, play it. Play it for all it's worth. No wow. one should deny themselves their true nature. Well, what's the oh, what's to tell? I'm a magistrate back in the city. It's all rather tedious. Okay, well, whatever. Oh, I got a severed hand. Interesting. Ew, gross. All right, anyway, moving on. Um, you know, that's not too bad. Gail's not that fantastic anyway. First playthrough I did, didn't even, I didn't have them. I can't remember why. Just never picked them up. For some reason. Wow, I was not, I thought he was just gonna fantasize about it. So now we know that uh, we cross over into the realm of reality. Zoru was right. Yellow as a toad and twice as ugly. The thing's dangerous. Leave it for the goblins to kill. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. Holy hells. Under elf. Lay time, I miss her. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. If you value your life, walk away. Let's see what happens. Oh dear. Oh, oh, they're lucky. Demaze. Come, I miss her. Now. Enough gawking. Get me down. All right, let's go get her down. Observe and listen. Enough talking. You'll get hear goblins down. before you see them. As you said, the tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Careful. She obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. It's a crash. It many things. A hatchery, a training grounds, a shelter. Ah, please for me to indulge. Clear. When infected with a gay tadpole, we must report to Augustil for purification. Um, I'm gonna pretend I know what any of that stuff is. Um, let's you go find the crash. You have ally from Crash Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me later. Wow, that sounds dubious at best. But I won't trust her. Not until I've gotten the measure of her. You have a sharp tongue, elf. Would that your mind proved its equal. Half elf. I suppose the finer details are lost on a creature like you. Come. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. 
Yeah, we can roll with that for now. Alright, let's go ahead and level her up. I think she's a fighter. Yeah. What you got there? Alright, well... I do want to dish her as fast as possible. Stick her back at the camp because... She's just incredibly annoying. Bossy. Kinda wants to kill everything. Alright, let's go. Speaking of killing... We'll kill some goblins. I hear shouting up ahead. Yep, I'm gonna start up here at the top this time. But be careful. Out of sight, out of mind. Open the bloody gate! Nobody gets in! Zevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Open the gates, Evlor, now! You let goblins here? Where is the druid? Please! There's no time! I'm gonna shake this arrow at you. By the nine hells! Open the gates! <clears throat> Toast. Shit! Form a line. <laughs> it's not much of a line. Whoa. Damnable roach. Provoke the blade and suffer its sting. All righty. Oh. Very damn nice. Right, let's go ahead and use the bow. Oh, that's pretty crappy. Yes, I'm gonna move you over here. Life comes easy these days. Right, we're gonna do this rapier here on this one here. Good, dead. Loot it, and we're gonna jump down here to the next one. True too. I guess it's not bad. Oh, did I just waste that? There we go. Oh. Ah, whatever. My sickle and soul. Just runs by the other one. Okay, let's see what we got going on here now. This way. Let's go ahead and loot this one here real quick. Still alive. There we go. Let's get down here as far as we can now.
Oh, missed it. Smoke that one. Okay, the bugbear and uh, goblin brawler. Goblin brawler's down. How'd you miss? Good hit. Sometimes the only way out is through. And that's it. Toast. Wait. Oh, no, we're missing one. Oh, I forgot about that thing. That was the last Here we go. Inside! All of you, more may follow! Open the gate! Open the gate. Close the gate. All your stupid stuff. What's hiding here? No, but we're gonna go take your stuff. But there's another one around here. Aha! This should be an interesting conversation with Tell Dark Earth. children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! Hmm. Ah, uh, the backstabbing. Pull your claws in, Underelf. Show some respect. This man saved your pathetic life. Well, I didn't ask for any goddamn help. Please, you were begging me to open the gate. Anything to save yourself, you coward! The human's eye twitches. He's about to blow. Hang on a minute. And... There we go. Alright. So that... Um... I just... Gonna stay back and watch. Oh, should have done that a long time ago. Arrogant prick had it out for me from day one. Can't imagine no why. Leaves my people out cold. <laughs> uh, let's let him speak. He was right though. Coming back to this hellhole was a mistake. No amount of gold can put right. I'd rather face another round of goblins than stay in this pit. Okay, sure. Uh, you do you, I guess. Talk to this dude here. <laughs> mm, regression. Okay. A cheap shot. I should have expected that. What I didn't expect was help out there from a drow. Thank you. I'm Zevlor. Uh, just something against drow. I meant no insult. It's simply that yours are a people at war with themselves. I've <laughs> never known them to care for outsiders. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. I'm the poor there have druids. been several attacks by different Yet. monsters. The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Nobody's welcome anymore. They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. Um, uh, sure, Thank whatever. I'm just going to leave. For your help out there. We're raised to fear the drow, but you've earned your place here. I'll make sure everyone here knows that. See that you do. All right. Well, uh, let's go down to the little merchant guy down here and uh, dump some of our crap. 
something's on my mind. This is about your precious borders gate. I care about our lives. Refugees, adventurers, and even a drow. No one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Uh, sure, whatever, half man. What are you selling? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Yep, lots of bits and bobs here. You got weapons, armor. All right, the big thing right now is just to go ahead and barter away all the junk um, because that's going to give us some rep with this guy. See, I'm moving the needle there. I want to use the junk stuff first. One damage just ain't enough. I uh, don't really care. Probably never use it. Nope. Nope. Okay. Let's do some more pot lid. Give you the onyx. Key is not to give too much. I'll keep the hand for now. You never know what I might want to nibble later. And those bottles. And the bloodstone. Silver locket isn't worth that much. Burnished necklace. Uh, spike shield. That. Stupid hat. Getting there. There we go. All right, cool. So now all of this stuff would be cheaper for me to buy. Um, and now we can switch over to trade and I can just sell all the stuff I don't want. And get that money for it too, so. All right, that's looking pretty good for now. Um, let's see what we got here. Spells Thief. I think that's, a, yeah, it's a long bow. Padded armor. Padded armor is actually not bad. Let's go ahead and get that. Okay. All right, so that's pretty good for now. We'll come get other stuff later. Don't really need to buy a bunch of stuff now. Sylvanas, guide your path. Yeah, sure, bud, whatever. Of course it does. You would right. choose strangers over us. Let's go bust into their conversation here. Can we stop? Bells. We can't just leave. The kin! I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? No. What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. You don't look like a or fighter either. That's fine too. Uh, say nothing. Roland's right, sis. We should leave while we still can. Or would you deny your brother here his chance at fortune in Baldur's Gate? Ah, uh, fine. Let's sneak away like God's damned cowards. Okay. But if something happens to these people, it's on us. I hope you know that. Eh. You wouldn't be able to stop me anyway. Alright, let's go find this guy over here. Children! Go on. Give me a best shot. Not Dead. bad. Again. Dead. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, 
I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. Oh, that's you can kiss do of this. death right there. Um good advice, why not? <laughs> You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The blade of frontiers at your sh The man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. You are the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Mm hmm. Yes, we both carry. Uh. Peer further into his mind. You see the fiend again and ignite with Will's rancor. She is an infernal war devil, a threat to the living, evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate, a champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Her name Isn't is the same thing. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her, she'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Hmm. Uh, well, let's go look for a healer together. Sorry, but there's no room for me. Uh, on the other hand, yeah. Fine. I shall wait in our Yes, case. good. Ready and willing. Yeah, we'll bring you back when we find the crash. When we slaughter all of your people. Hmm. The famous Blade of Frontiers in the flesh. Clever, this hero act you've got going. Hero, Blade. Name strangers gave me. My friends call me Will. Excellent. If we ever become friends, I'll know what to call you. Oh my, <laughs> this is going to be a fun journey. <laughs> yeah, it's a way of looking at it. Any All right. Children? Well, let's see. We need to level up again here. Uh, I want to be level three before I take on the next part. So probably, oh, you know, we could do the harpies. Okay, starters. I'm going to go do the Burning Hands. I want the Agonizing Blast, the Repelling Blast. Let's go run down here and take on the uh, Harpies. Experience, experience, experience. Where are my stats? Let my daughter oh, go okay. right now! She's a thief, hell spawn! And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Radrashem, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <laughs> like a little midget guy. Now we're tough. We've got a bear. That's great. Who's <laughs> the bear? Um. I don't see where my experience points are. Oh, there they are. Alright, well, let's go kill some more stuff. Oh. Come, Magrin. Give him a chance. You, step back. We'll not tolerate drow in here. Oh, really? Well, I'm just going to ignore it. Another step, and Magrim will tear you open like a sack of grain. <sighs> hmm. Uh, if you weren't for me, it'd be Get overrun back. by goblins. Force my hand, and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Why would she allow one of them? I... I suppose so. You! Apparently, Corga wants to see you. Go ahead. But a word of warning. 
One wrong move and every single animal here will tear you apart. Mm-hmm. I'm scared. I'm going to remember this. <laughs> I am going to definitely re um actually let's go up here first. I'll leave this stuff up here. No, no, stop. Please stop playing. I'm just going to take your food. A couple turns should do it. Ah, oh, puke. Alright, well, we can sell that later. All right, we'll talk to her later. I don't really need to talk to her right now. Let's get out of here. Instead, we're going to go down here where the harpies are. Oh, okay. Right over here. There's going to be four of them. It's beautiful. Is it now? Is it really? Um, let's park ourselves over here. All right, that looks pretty good. Break up the party. All right, let's stick the Will the people. right about here, and we'll stick Shadowheart here. Starion can go right over here. No one stopped me yet. I will kind of go over here. I think I have to talk to this stupid me. kid first, anyway. Please. Shh. Listen. Your favorite drownings will take place in shallow water. <laughs> just a slice of the ankle tendons. Wow. That is just nuts. All right, we're gonna listen here. Look at him smiling. Oh my god, this is terrible. A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. A harpy's charm. Let's struggle. The suffocating yearning suddenly fades as the spell breaks. You are free. There it is. Yes, everything's gonna be fine once I get there. Yep, it's gonna be fine, dude. She's just gonna kill you. But, um, we've got bigger fish to fry because there's three other harpies. Alright, let's go ahead and fire. Oh. Ow. That looks very damn nice. Shall we cut and run? Kill it. Nice. Good job. <laughs> Throws a rock. That was effective. Ow. Yeah, love it. Knock it back. Feel that anguish. Kill it. Almost. Dead. Heal up. Splat. 
flat. Alright, let's go ahead and loot some of this stuff here. Let's see what we have here. Let's take a look. Okay, you might not make it in time. What's this? Oh, I can't even catch my oh the luring voices, I guess, slowing me down. All right, not really that interested in saving the kid, but I am interested in killing the harpy while it's distracted. Ah, critical miss. It's terrible. Nice. No holding back. Coming through. Probably finish it off. Yeah, toasted. All right, kid. Are they gone? <sighs> They're like tasty little tiefling kids. <laughs> Will is inspired. All right, yeah, well, we saved the kid, so just chill out. All right, let's go ahead and loot some of this stuff. There's a few other things to loot around here, too. Should be a chest over here. There's some other stuff over uh, a little ways, but I'm, I'm not strong enough to jump over there to get it, so I'll come back later before I leave the area. Loot those. Maybe there's really no point. I don't know. I'll have to double check and see what's over there. But for now, this is sufficient. These boots uh, have seen there's some stuff up in here somewhere. Yeah. Come up here. All right, let's see. While he's making his way over there, yeah, just need to get some more experience. Kill some more stuff. Take the rip cages too, polished dagger, another rip cage. Good. Let's get out of here. Let's start running over here in this direction. So I guess I need to go talk to this person over here. Here somewhere. There. Probably going to go in here, do this scene here, and then stop uh, for this time being. It's been about 50 minutes. Ugh. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. A death viper. You have milked that poison before. A single drop of it could kill that child in a heartbeat. Oh, no. Do nothing? Uh, we will speak soon four. enough. First, judgment must be passed. The parasite eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. 
The snake's hiss of approval reveals its intentions. Should the child struggle, it is poised to strike. The mm. death of a child. A timeless <laughs> tragedy that Damn. never grows Oh, old. no. Oh, no. All right, what do we got? <sighs> it's like to kill a child, but her doesn't snap out of it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Flick your eyes. Okay, I'm just going to detect the thoughts on Kaga instead. That's pretty crazy. All right. Let's see what we've got. Halsin is gone. I am first druid now. I will take control and prove my authority. People think like that. Um. Hmm. Number one. Now, Rath. <laughs> no. Uh-oh. Tila to me. Oh man. Let me oh I was gonna say maybe the demon child is immune to the venom, but apparently not. By the gods, Korga, what have you done? It's not my fault. The Bury snake the did remains. it. Continue the right. And the parents? They're just outside. This Bury them too. We'll take word oh. once I've spoken to him. We must focus on the right. She's okay, you want me to tell them that she killed me? She knew the danger. She still tried to run. <sighs> What's with these rats? Ah, uh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Gotta wait till nobody's elf. looking. In our grove, on this day. A sign, or rather, a gift. Who oh. better to understand a watchful broodmother than a beloved child of Loth? Hmm. Okay. Uh... You protected your own. Then we agree. Preservation is not luxury. It is not zealotry. It is necessity. Mm -hmm. A viper bears her fangs defending her brood. Is it not her nature to strike at invaders? I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite has resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. Uh, let's see here. Do what you want, none of my concern. Then I was wise to grant you entry. And you'd be wise to heed my words. Uh-oh. I want you to provide your services to the tiefling leader. Zevlor, he's called. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. Hmm. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Oh, yeah, the Viper. Uh, prattle all you want. Then they soon know the sting of my venom. Right. Get out. We have no more business. Whatever. Don't care. I have business with other people. So, and that's going to be over here. We're going to talk to this lady who's going to... Hmm. Cares more about the stupid bird. I see you. Just give me a moment. Uh... Oh, wait. This may be There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Oh, yeah? Now, what? Trow. Last time I saw one of you folk, he tried to slit me open. I hope you're more agreeable. We'll see. That's neither here nor there. Look, you obviously want something. What is it? Uh, healing. I do what I can. For most folks, that's enough. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Hmm. Uh, something crawled in my eye. Crawled in? Some sort of bug? Or... 
Wait, did it look like a tadpole? But from your worst nightmare? All slime, teeth, and tentacles? Nah. Nah. Um. Let's do number two. That's a serious condition. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. Cool. We need to be quick. This way. There's something in that vessel. Yes, Take a closer look. It. Don't worry about him on the table. I'm not in the habit of killing Drow. Okay. He attacked Master Halson and I in the woods, leading a pack of goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Seems so. Give Master Halson a right start. Oh, what? It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. You don't have to be here for this. I'd like to stay, if it's all the same. All right. Let's see what we can do. The plant. She shifts uneasily, hesitating. Something's off. It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? Uh, fell from a ship in the sky. Uh, yeah, let's fell from the ship in the sky. Protected from on high. Sounds like the drow. Master Halson said he was tougher than he had any right to be. How'd you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. Mm, mind flare ship. A mind flare ship. But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. You poke me with your sh pokey stick. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Sure, I swear. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Uh, should be changing. Yeah. Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flayer is born. The thing in your skull, though? It's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections, and it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Matter of time, good news, hmm. Tracking victims, Hard yeah. Hard to say, but there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna, and I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Well, maybe he didn't find anything there. Maybe he didn't make it all the way there. All right. Uh, I think so. I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. 
Oh. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that so? Okay, I guess I could take that. Thank you. It would mean everything to the grown. Nah, to me. Just I wish I could tell you. Out of my head. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Mm-hmm. I'm sure I'll remember that as I'm being taken over by the uh, parasite. All right, I there's some things to steal in here, but I can do that later. Uh, particularly useful, just stuff that's valuable I can sell. Don't really care about these guys. Care about the wolf. Let's go up here and get out. Oh. Ah. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and bug out on this place. Uh, we're gonna come right up here. These people are probably gonna ask about their kid. I'll just go ahead and tell them. Maybe I'll have an interesting dark urge option. Unless you have news of Arabella, I don't want to hear it. Hmm. Yeah, number four. Coca. Coca did. What? No. No. That snake. That. That. Ah! Wow. Um. Hmm. We should have stopped her. Yeah, you should have, Brad. Do you hear me? It was Coca. Oh, God. Cursed druids. Let's talk to him. Them all. Leave me. Okay. Leave me. Okay. All right. You don't have to tell me twice. No. Just once each. Uh, let's see what we got going on over here. Looks like I can lock pick this with impunity. That up. Nice. Got in here. All right, we're gonna run by this dude. We're gonna sell some stuff, and then we're gonna park ourselves over next to the uh, the next place that we're gonna go. Need anything else? Yeah, I need to sell some crap. Of course, but please remember, you're not the only one in need. Well, yeah, but you're selling this stuff for money, so I don't think need really enters into it, does it? Half man. Some expensive bowls. Uh, hammer, rope, polished dagger, regular dagger. Uh, the skulls. All right, that's not bad. We got plenty of health, I think, for what lies ahead. Uh, let's see if we got anything new. Can I sort this? Uh, apparently not. All right. Um, I'm not really seeing anything here that pops out at me as something I need yet. I don't really need any of that. Don't really need that. All right, screw it. I think we're good. Sylvanas, be with you. Sure, bud. Whatever. Let's get out of here. See the mechanism operate. Why does this keep happening? He was joking about octa soup just a moment ago. What? Come on, Ricker. So now what? We dig a hole and be done with him? We. We could say a prayer. We should have time for that. Ah, uh, the mechanism doesn't move. I'm actually kind of surprised. I thought it would. 
Oh well. Alright, let's hold this over here. Looks like, uh... Hmm. Nothing. Let's go over this way now. Just floating out there. Okay, this is the area here where we're going to be setting up for the next part of our little adventure here. Okay, so now... Action, bonus action, cantrips. I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Okay, she's only missing a single spell slot. And this still got his spell slots. So this should work pretty good here. So yeah, basically what's going to happen here is uh, when we come back is we'll probably sneak up behind this guy and probably just stab him right in the back or potentially even push him off. But I think stabby's better because then I should be able to still push him if I need to. And then there is a magic user on the other side, but, uh, and then these guys. So then after that, it's basically to dash right around this corner and have these all folks set up so as they come out, basically one by one, uh, or the first pair will come one right after the other. The magic user will come last and then kill them all. And I think that's it. I think there's only the, uh, you know, or, He's standing right there. I could potentially attack that so it drops on him. You aren't as good at grave robbing as you are at excuses. Just be careful. Like my mum always said, fools rush in. Level two, level two, level two, level two. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Now let's go ahead and save this thing here. Uh, this is a new save, so this is going to be number two. All right, we'll come back later.